and we were in the same department, College of uh, Accounting, Business and Administration, with major in uh, accounting. Yes, yes. With, with major in accounting. And we were in the same class together, and we graduated. He did attend the university, Chicago State University, and he graduated in uh, 1979. Okay, as you did. As I did. Uh, in, in, you know, 1979. in 1979. Yes, yeah, so I'm here to testify that he did attend the university. If you come out to say you went to school with somebody, you have to prove it. You came on air, there were no pictures. You came on air, there were no enough proof and everything. He has to be able to come to proof. And part of proving it also means subjecting himself to other media. So he should come to arise probably. 15 minutes. We're waiting. Let's interview him. Yeah. Let's ask him more questions and all of that. And I'm Hello guys, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. And welcome to this YouTube channel. If you don't know, first time we use this channel, make enough it to hit on the red subscribe button. If you don't subscribe before, thank you and God bless you. And today, the first time we see this Facebook page, Papa Kevin One O One, make it offer to like and follow this page for more videos updates to come your way. My people, wonder shall never end. Wonder shall never end. It don't happen. Don't be smart, see. Bola Ahmed, if you finally schoolmates don't come outside. Yes, now. <laughs> Bola Ahmed, if you schoolmates, where they got at school for Chicago State University. No, we say Nigeria. Chicago State University don't come outside. I go and play video for Lamu and see what it is. So, see. So kind old people, the way they make us laugh for this country, not be small. He, you know, like, I bet before we go into this news, eh, make I just forgive now time when I watch. Before that, please, if you know say they follow me for Facebook, and you know they see my video, really say for that Facebook and the header, please follow me for YouTube. Subscribe to this, my YouTube channel, Africa Jamal First Lead TV. In case I post video, you'll be the first place to see it. I mean, you know, fail to please follow me for Instagram. Let's eat 10,000 followers on Instagram. As you do so, God bless you. Guys, take your time, watch this video. Then we they come put our own take on this issue. Do me a favor, eh? Share the video. Bola Ahmed if you this man no go. In short, eh? Watch this video, we we'll come back. A public affairs analyst, Duro Jaye Ogun Soya, was trending on Wednesday after he stated during a live television interview that he was a classmate of President Bola Ahmed Tinubu at the Chicago State University and graduated alongside the president from the Department of Accounting and Business Administration. In 1979, well, during the interview, Ogun Soya accused those disputing Tinubu's academic records of being mischievous because Tinubu was a governor for eight years and would have had a university degree. So uh, we met in the school, in Chicago State University, mm -hmm. and we were in the same department, College of uh, Accounting, Business and Administration, with major in uh, accounting. Yes, yes. With, with major in accounting. And we were in the same class together. And we graduated. He did attend the university, Chicago State University, and he graduated in uh, 1979. Okay, as you did. As I did. Uh, in in 1979. Yes, yeah, so I'm here to testify that he did attend the university and he was a good student. People were being mischievous in the first place because he was a governor for eight years, somebody who worked for Mobile for several years. And you're contesting that he didn't go to college university. How is that possible? I mean, I, can, I cannot imagine how that is possible. That they are claiming that he didn't go to the. Sometimes the president might be embellished, you know, sometimes, but that does not mean that he didn't attend university. He did attend university. He was a governor for eight years. <laughs> well, all right. All right. I, I mean, I don't know if you need a, a university degree to be a governor, but, but certainly you do need one to, uh, you know, work at Mobile. So, I mean, um, Mr. Ogun Soya has definitely caused a lot of reactions as well. Let me take one from Ileoma who wrote, It's been 23 years since Sinabu's Chicago qualifications were first challenged and suddenly Dro Jaye Ogunsoya, a public affairs analyst with no digital footprint, suddenly remembers he attended school with Tinubu and used to mock his accent. Well, Nigeria is a funny place. Another Twitter user, Raymond, goes, A simple Google search of Dro Jaye Ogunsoya shows that this man didn't exist till two days ago. No linking, Facebook, or even Chicago State University link outside his ambiguous claims. Do these clowns think this is the 1980s or 1990s, information is everywhere and accessible. 
Well, Raymond, I mean, he may not have a LinkedIn or, yeah. you know, a digital footprint, um, and not everybody does. Let's say he's not digital. But that style. actually was uh, the rhetoric on social media, yes, whether I mean, or not, you know, where did he come from? So, and I, I, it's quite curious, OG. Yes. That's the first thing that came to mind as well. When I saw, oh, finally, someone has come out as a witness yes. to give an interview to not just talk about the fact that they went to university together, mm -hmm. but even give a character um, witness in terms of well, the kind of student that he was. Mm -hmm. Now, Mr. Durojaye Omusonya can come out as a student to say what he wants to say, but he cannot. we can't take that as a certificate. We can't mm -hmm. take that as records from the university. It's good to see, you know, people, you know, so, I mean, if someone come out to testify that you and I were seatmates in university. But beyond that, people have made questions and where are the pictures? Did they not take pictures in 1979? You know, the people not, do we not have records again? Why is Chicago State University, you know, not being very forthcoming with regards to information? Yes, they've said, oh, they, 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 we had to go the, the Atik, um, Atik Obubaka has gone to court to try and get get them to release information with regards to the educational qualifications of President Balatinubu. But this has to go down as one of the most controversial in terms of the credentials of a president in Nigeria. I mean, we have cases like this often, but this is quite interesting. And I think just put the matter to rest. Mm -hmm. Certificate. Show us evidence of the fact that you went to university. And by the way, the fact that you worked in a certain organization doesn't mean, I'm sure you, um, some people will know of Oluyole, where they have said, so it's is not Oluwole. 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 Well, that shows Oluwole. I don't patronize the services. Oluwole, Oluwole is about Where you print fake certificates. Yeah, so I'm just saying that that's not all these things. Just give us the real, that's what Nigerians just want to know the truth. As regards this Mr. Duro and this conundrum and everything, if you come out to say you went to school with somebody, you have to prove it. You came on air, there were no pictures. You came on air, there were no enough proof and everything. He has to be able to come to proof. And part of proving it also means subjecting himself to other media. So he should come to arise probably 15 minutes. We're waiting. Let's interview him. Yeah. Let's ask him more questions and all of that. And I'm sure he also knows that there's a case currently going on in the court as regards and let me go back to it as regards a subpoena by Nauru Eba well, that that case has now come out to light again well, that petition that we are seeing and that petition is, is the out one. there you this know because some characters yeah. said all sorts of lies and shenanigans mm -hmm. so you see let's just tell the truth the truth will set all of us free right. the last time 23 years ago when this case came up it was in, in the state house of assembly that helped quell the tide of the case now it's back up again let's just yeah. Full disclosure. I just wanted to quickly yeah. clarify that um, um, petition that was up there. It was re uh, in, on September 8th, a uh, response from CSU to Atiku stating that, you know, Tinubu did attend the Chicago State University, as well as the fact that they cannot truly confirm the, um, you know, originality of his certificate because they consider it as a, you know, one of those, uh, <laughs> how do you call it, a, a praise certificate of, of some sort. So well, that was that petition up there. Yeah is that this matter of President Tinubu's academic qualification has been on the table for more than 20 years, yes. since he was governor. Okay, why is it that when he was governor of Lagos State, <laughs> nobody showed up? <laughs> so, this uh, Duro Jayo Gusoya, or what is his he name? To arise, you know, let us talk. He was not around he come here. over 20 years ago. <laughs> and in any case, if you look at him, he looks uh, quite younger than the president. Yeah. So, he I, you know, come to arise maybe it's on the basis of that that David Hunde. Uh, is now saying that this witness, this character witness, yeah. this uh, classmate witness, uh, is uh, fake. Yeah. Because David Undeyi has said that, I'm sure, you know, it will be responded to by interested parties. Okay, when uh, President Buhari was said not to have attended secondary school, he gathered uh, uh, his classmates, they took photographs with him Abi. in the villa. Why, 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 is so, why is this so difficult? You know, right. when uh, it was uh, Dimeji Bakole's uh, time, within a week, Yes, you know, and uh, they put a picture. And they put a picture. Put pictures out. Pictures out. Okay, yes. Okay, this one had to take up to 20 years. 23 years. I, 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 I think we, 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 have, we have to do right. something about qualification. Right. Yeah. Anybody that does not have a basic degree 
and anybody whose classmates will show up after 20 years. <laughs> oh, you, oh, whose secondary school classmates will have to come to the villa to validate. Yeah. Look, that's ridiculous, well, man. Right. In a country where some people have three master's degrees, yes. double PhDs, yes. why is you know, it that is the division that two point. people? Well, right. That will be uh, division three people <laughs> that will be the ones uh, say, saying they want to rule Nigeria. All right, well said, guys. Hmm. When I hear the story, I see everything, I see what happened. See, me, I don't know who be all this clown. Where they come and call it deceive us. Come they tell us, see, man. Now, so, see, for the past 23 years, why don't not come outside? Why, you know, why would one? This man don't go see Bola met 15 Ibu for Aso Villa. They don't discuss, do what they want to do. They come say, now, nah, arise now, they are waiting for you to come to their station, come and discuss. May they ask you deep questions, then you go see stammer for your mouth. Now, people are met if the bus station where you go, Congo, they talk. Pose, free, free, discuss what you want to discuss. No, they are calling you now in a rice TV. Go and discuss it there. You went to school with Bola Ahmed, if you know that. Where is the picture? No picture. 1979, when I graduate, when I graduate together, where is the grass picture? No? Ah, you don't have any. But you went to school with him. He was your classmate. Bola Ahmed, if you did where? He did that. He did this. Then, where are these pictures? Definitely not Chicago. That's how we will never get camera for Nigeria. There, all these things all they exist for this Western world. We will not get all those things. At least, even they don't exist, it will be black and white. Where is it? You don't have it. But you want to come and tell us that you went to school with Bola Met 15 No, you want us to believe that. No, we can't believe that. We can't take it. So, for you, now, bring out evidence. Telling us you went to school. Anybody can come out and say, I went to school with Bola Met 15 Yeah, anybody can that. They can come outside now and say, I went to school with this. Yes, no problem. But we need evidence. When I see what you they talk for here, when I see Ruby Abati Chomian, we have people with degree, better degree for ours, PhD, a lot. People go to school for Nigeria, finish school well. But all these second class, third class people, we will not reach anything. Now they'll come to use the thing they play. When I see what you talk, like Ruby Abati is a lawyer. But he went to school well, but he's a journalist. But you can imagine this set of people who will not go to school, who will not sabi anything. Now they will come to use their break, what they do, for people, for people for the country. So, Mr. Ma, whatever you call yourself, see, we not take others your play play talk. If you want us to believe you, bring concrete evidence. Let us see. We want to see the court. Show us evidence. Not you sitting there, you don't go out so long. Go collect money for Bola Met, if you need Now, but you know, Eba, the lawyer, don't see, he don't fight the case come at it. Now they wanna go no say before now they do now they go. But this one is really interesting. This case now they interesting. Before now they do now they go with her. But this time, Bola met if people go no when he mess with the wrong citizens. He go know when he mess with the wrong citizens. 200 million Nigerian citizens, he go know when he mess with us. You hear me? So don't be the only way we let you the coin, the talk anywhere we don't know anything. Cause I go hand this video here. As you make a show now, but I met if you need to see a classmate, don't come and say I can't say get classmates. And we want to see the end of this classmate. I want to bring more evidence for us. Make we see. I hand this video. Please help me to share this video as you do so. God bless you. I'm making enough to please follow me for YouTube, subscribe to my YouTube channel, Africa German for Slate TV. In case I post video, you'll be the first place to see it. I mean enough to follow me for Instagram. Let's eat 10,000 followers on Instagram. As you do so, God bless you. See you guys in my next video. Stay safe, guys, and bye-bye.